Winters are a season of chills and colors in North India. Good morning. Let me speak to you about Dianthus, a prominent color providing flower of this season. Dianthus is a biennial, annual or even perennial flower from the carnation family. Unlike carnations, Dianthus cannot be used as cut flowers and rather bunches are beautifully in your planters. It is native to Europe and Asia. They are characterized by their spicy fragrance, which is quite similar to cinnamon and clove. Its flowers are usually five-petaled, often with a frilled or zigzag edge. They are sometimes also called pinks, since most of them have varying shades of pink. They are small and bushy. The flowers are usually pink, but may also be found in red and white hues. They have thick stems. Quite easy to grow, Dianthus can be started from very light seeds in your seed trays or simply get them from the nearest nursery. Plant them in full sun, partial shade or anywhere they will receive at least 6 hours of sun. The plants need fertile, well-brained soil. It is easy to care for them. Water the plants when dry and apply fertilizer every 6 to 8 weeks. A normal dose of cow dung manure or liquid panchagavya shall do lots of good. Bunching them in grow bags gives them a nice bouquet ethos. In India, seeds are sown during September to October for winter flowering. Seeds can be planted in June to September for early flowering. Dianthus is a must have for any garden and it will certainly beautify your garden even more. The name Dianthus is derived from a combination of the Greek words Dios, meaning God, and Anthos, meaning flower, or flower of the gods. Please subscribe, like, and share our post using the icons below. Please do check out some great recipes at mencanmakehomes.com. Visit us at Early Progressions Faridabad to know lots more. See you soon, green buddies.